As countries all over the world continue to battle the coronavirus, Local 12's Brad Underwood shows us how a local college student is doing his part to help a country in Africa. There you go. Cell phone video taken by Fred McBaggan Laurie shows his low cost ventilator works. As you can see, it's really, really tiny, really portable. The engineer, inventor, educator, and provost and president at Academic City College in Ghana is now working to save lives. In Ghana, there are 29 million people, but only 67 ventilators. For me, that was insane. I was like, 67, the U.S. has 200,000. Asher Williamson is from Westchester. He's currently a mechanical engineering student at the University of Dayton. He says he read about McBag and Lori in the student paper. McBag and Lori is a UD grad. Everyday materials like leather, plastic piping, wood, and vehicle parts, McBag and Lori has two ventilator prototypes. To produce them, cost about $172, and they can be put together in less than a half hour. He's got a mission. He's got the, the mindset and the knowledge to do this. What can I do to help him make that come true, like make that be a reality and make uh, a couple ventilators? And so um, I actually called him two days later. Now, Williamson is fundraising to help pay for a variety of sensors for the prototypes. Once they have them, the ventilator will be ready for FDA review and testing in Ghana. To me, it was like a no brainer where I was like, I need to figure out a way that I can help people. And that this is a way I can help someone and still learn how to like build a ventilator. Like right now, everyone should be doing what they can for the coronavirus. Like I think if you're not trying to do something or do your little part, I think it, it makes it a whole lot harder. So far, Williamson has raised nearly $2,000. Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. Amazing. If you'd like to help or follow the progress on those ventilators, we have a link for you on local12.com.